There's a couple ways to tie lead cord together. This particular knot passes through your line guides as well as the guides on your rods. Makes a really nice strong connection. So first uh, we got our lead core here. Uh, we're going to start by slowly kind of pulling back the shielding to expose some of the lead. So we're going to take out about six or so inches of lead. Uh, we can simply just give that a little snip. Then we're going to pull the shielding back out. Then we're going to take our mono. And one little trick with your mono piece is try and get a nice little cut on an angle. And then we're simply just going to feed the mono into the shielding. So we'll put it all the way in until it kind of stops feeding. So now we're going to pinch this connection. We're simply going to take our spool of lead core and we are going to do an overhand knot. Now we just have to position the knot nice and close to where we inserted the line. And we're simply just going to pull that nice and tight. There we go. We have a super strong connection. When we do fire line, instead of doing one knot, sometimes we will actually take our line over again and do a second overhand knot just to ensure we got a nice secure connection just down from the first one. There you go. And that's how you join lead core uh, to either a braid or a monofilament line. That's it.